So I thought I'd do another little section on deaf teen life. And as you know by the title of this video, it is about audiograms, specifically my audiograms. So in the past year and a little bit, I have had five audiograms. I was born with a 30% conductive hearing loss, so that means the bones in my ears was the part that couldn't hear. No one told me, no one really remembered until about a year and a half ago when I was like, oh, I really, really can't hear anymore. Like, I'm really struggling. And I went to the audiologist and this is that audiogram. This one's my left ear. As you can see, there's like a little, little drop. Like, it's mostly okay. And this is my right ear. And the little blips at the top, that's my bone conduction. So I had a 30% conductive hearing loss, like I was born with. So that was kind of like funky to see. So anyway, that happened and I actually had to do a hearing test twice because she thought I just had wax in my ears. Um, no, I didn't, I had hearing loss. Uh, I got hearing aids, I got tiny little um, trial hearing aids and I had those and it was great and fantastic and I decorated them. I'll put a little picture of my hearing aids in. We ordered hearing aids through a different audiologist and I went to go get fitted for them and they were like, you know what, we just want to do another hearing test. This is the next one. So this line right there, it's kind of like in between 20 and 30 decibels. That, anything above that, that is normal hearing. Anything below it is a hearing loss. I have is a 55 decibel hearing loss in my left ear and a 63.5 in my right ear. With like fairly good speech scores right here, the speech scores, I have 76 in my right ear and 84 in my left ear. That's about it. They typically don't fall out the bottom part for me. I don't know why. I think they just don't care enough. After I looked at that, I was kind of like, yeah, no, this more fits how I hear, how I feel I hear. That was in February. My next hearing test I got in June because I was gonna go visit an ENT. And this is the beautiful hearing test I got. So it had dropped. So it went from a 55 decibel hearing loss on the left to, oh, they didn't put it in this one, that's rude, to more than a 55 decibel hearing loss. Um, I can't actually say what I have because they didn't write it at the top. So over here you can see, like there was a giant difference between where my left ear is, which is the blue line, and where my right one is. So that like dropped all the way and it hit 90 decibels. So this one I had done in December. This is normal hearing. This is big hearing loss. So I have a 93.33 decibel hearing loss. Pretty significant, I'm pretty deaf. In comes my most recent audiogram. And this one, I'm gonna tell you all, I cried a fair amount about. This is the one that I sobbed for a good hour about because it's just absolutely overwhelming. I know it doesn't make any difference to how I experience life, but seeing it on paper was really difficult. I hit the bottom of the audiogram. There is nothing, like, the machine doesn't go any louder. I don't have any hearing left. The little squiggly lines mean no response. So no response all the way down. All of my audiograms in succession. First audiogram to my latest one. As you can see, there's a big difference. So thank you for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it and I'll see you again soon.